Hey there guys, what's going on? Pokemon Lego here today, and I'm back with another episode of the Pokemon Y Wonder Red Lock. So, uh, in the last episode we defeated the gym and made it, or no, sorry, in the last episode we made it across that route into Lumio City. <coughs> but, um, yeah, I'm gonna be on vacation the next couple of days, so I don't know if I'm gonna upload this video, uh, this evening to kind of compensate, or if I'm gonna upload it when I get back. I might just upload it when I get back, I think, which will probably be like Saturday or Sunday, probably Sunday. Um, but yeah, I probably won't have any uploads until then, so I apologize ahead of time, but I'm hoping to get a few uploads while I am, uh, visiting some people, some family. So, yeah, uh, let's go ahead. We're gonna go and visit Professor Sycamore's lab. His, uh, crib, as we like to call it. And we're gonna go ahead, and good, we've got Sigilith and High up at the front. If y'all remember in the last episode, we got High the Pikachu. Like, Hi, what you doing? Not High as in, you've been doing drugs. I just wanted to clarify. Okay, I'm sorry about that. It's kind of blurred. Okay, so... Let's go ahead. Let's walk up in here. And that girl is waiting outside. I forget her name. You've traveled a long way from Vanderbilt Town. You're finally here. The professor can't wait to meet you. He's on the third floor. But first, we're going to go ahead and stop on the second floor. Because there's an item we can pick up there. And we're going to grab that. And then we'll head on to the third floor. Where we'll finally meet Professor Sycamore. I mean, the professor, like, recruited us for all of this and stuff, and we haven't even met him yet, you know? Well, I guess we met him in our dream, technically, at the very beginning of the game, where we tell him what our name is. So I guess he just, like, goes into people's dreams. It's kind of a stalker, you know? He speaks his French and makes him feel all safe and stuff, when really he's, like, a stalker. Yeah, this is his crib. It's where he keeps all the po uh, drugs, I mean, Pokemon. And there he is. We're finally going to meet him in person and not just in a dream. So, we finally meet. <laughs> this isn't what I imagined to sound like, but it's what I want to do. Fantastic, you're here? Come on this way, won't you? He sounds more like Spanish. Then. But you know, they're playing Spanish music. Many thanks for coming all the way from Veneville Town. I'm Professor Sycamore. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. How is your Pokemon journey going so far? Have you met many different Pokemon? Fantastic. Let me have a quick look at your Pokedex and see. Hmm, so you've seen 39 kinds of Pokemon in Central Kalos then. Oh ho, the pages are getting filled. It's starting to look good. This, this Spanish voice only works with music. Well, now, you do have a certain je ne sais quoi. I'm sorry, I don't speak French. At least not a lot. I know how to say shut up in French. Fermi la bouche! Okay. I have a feeling about you. At first, I was thinking of choosing only one child from a town when I was deciding who to give a Pokemon to. <gasps> you ended a sentence with a preposition?! Oh my gosh. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. Oh! Professor Sycamore. Gosh! Grammar. In Vanneville Town. It was going to be the child of a veteran trainer, I know. About then, I learned that about the Rhyhorn racer, Grace, and her son were moving here. Here in the Kalos region, you're far away from everything you used to know. That really hit me right here. And it hit me. I should give you a Pokemon and have you travel around to Kalos. Hi, Professor! It's Shana! Well, this idiot again. <laughs> Sorry to have kept you waiting. Fantastic. Now let's all have a Pokemon battle. Your opponent shall be me. We got a battle with Mr. Spanish Sycamore. Let's battle, son! Homie G! Alright, we're battling Sycamore in his, on his own turf in his crib. Alright, he's gonna start off with his Bulbasaur. I totally didn't know that. That's totally not why I started off with Sigilyph. I didn't even need to look this up. I, I've, I was watching a guy do a Wonder Red Rock and I saw what this guy has. Plus, everyone remembers what Professor Sycamore has. And I was like, hey, you know, Grass is the first one in the Pokedex, so it's probably gonna be a Grass type that he starts off with. And what do you know? 24 for Sigilyph, a Squirtle. Oh, it looks like he's breaking the Pokedex order now, because it should be Charmander and it's Squirtle. So he's going to send out his Squirtle Turtle, while I send out my Pika Screwed. If I could rename this thing, I'd totally name it Pika Screwed. Oh, I almost, I almost pressed Play Nice. Yes, Thundershock. Wow, I almost pressed Play Nice. That would have been bad. <laughs> that would have been kind of bad. Alright, so that did a little less than half. It's going to whip its tail. I whip my tail back and forth, I whip my tail back and forth. So I guess Sycamore is a Spanish drug dealing marauder. Oh my gosh, that hurt! You son of a gun. That hurt. Wow, Hi has no defenses at all. It's a good thing she's partnered with Sigilyph, because Sigilyph can usually take a hit. 
Uh, yes, definitely switch Pokemon. I'm back in a second. With. Man, Charmander's Ember might kill Pikachu at the point she's at right now. Wait. No, I ended a sentence with a preposition. I, I ended it with now. Wait. Is now a preposition? It describes a place. So I think it is. But then again, that could be an adjective. But no. Definition of a preposition. Eh. I have no idea. Is that it describes a certain place or area. Well, I guess time. So... Alright, we're gonna go for a side wave, regardless of whether we ended the sentence with a preposition or not. And that Charmander is gonna go down, so we beat Professor Sycamore. Haha, -ha, you're too much for me. You're really something, aren't you? Oh yeah! Give me the money, son! I know what you get out off selling all that pot. I think I figured it out. Figured out what? Thorns, you are an interesting Pokemon trainer indeed. It'd be fast if... Fantastic. Whoops, I said fastic. Alright, who are we gonna take? Well, it doesn't even matter. I'm gonna take Squirtle. Sorry, Matt's way about us. I'm gonna be trading this guy away. <laughs> I have to, anyways. You picked Squirtle then. I see. That's simply wonderful. Oh, I just gonna pull him out of the PC box. I'm sorry, Libiscus. Don't worry. I Beedrill won't cheat on you and try to marry Squirtle. Squish, especially Squirtle's a female. Uh, no. And we get the Mega Stone, which really stinks now. <gasps> you took a picture! Look at the wall, guys! I didn't notice that before, but do you see that Sigilyph in the back? Look, 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 right there. He has a picture of my Sigilyph. He took a picture during our battle! That is patented Pokemon Legoer. You didn't, uh, you didn't ask permission, I don't think. Oh, great, now we get the whole lecture on Mega Evolution. It's when your Pokemon gets really big and fat and kills everyone. That's in a nutshell. You're feeling special, is that what you said? I don't even know. I wasn't paying attention. He was just like, like droning on. Everyone's like, it's so interesting. I'm like, I've heard this twice before. I've played, through, I've played this game like twice before. So I've already heard this and I'm just going to like block you out. But you know, Thorns is good at that. He does that a lot with all his friends. Did you say something, Shauna? See? Alright, so it looks like Dexio's sister slash girlfriend. At least I think that's... Okay, whatever. So I'll be able to meet them soon, then. Yes? I don't know. The children chosen by the professor. I wonder what potential they have. And here's one of them now! That's Thorns! Thorns, come here a sec. I bet it's gonna be more than a sec. Oh, you received a Pokedex from the professor, then. How wonderful! This is a wonderful thing indeed. You are the one of the chosen ones. I am Lysander. Or Lysander. Or Lysander! I've tried to learn as much about Pokemon as I can to help build a brighter future and kill everyone in the process. Professor Sycamore has taught me so much. Oh, I see you have a Holocaster. Now I'll just go in. I don't want to read this because I'm wasting your time. I'm trying to read all that Sycamore says really does waste your time. Alright, uh... He believes in killing people. Or actually Pokemon, I think. Doesn't like when I... I'm not gonna spoil anything. No! Let me go! I need to go battle on the next route, and I have to go to the stupid freaking cafe. Oh, this is gonna be a boring episode! Although, yeah, although first I'm gonna wonder trade away that Squirtle. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and wonder trade away- oh. Yeah, of course, I have to go with you. Lumio City may be very large, but if you stay on the main streets, you can get in gang fights. You sh okay, yeah, they're gonna do a little walk. Trevor's gonna become, or Trevor and Tyrano are gonna lead the two biggest gangs. The brains and the dancing. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and wonder trade away Squirtle, and I'll be with you guys in just a second. So we're wonder trading, and we got a, oh, we got a Mayanin! So as long as it's, like, level 20 or less, I'm not even gonna be using it right now, but as long as it's level 20 or less, we're gonna be good to go. By the way, that Squirtle was adamant, guys, so don't feel bad about me trading it away. I mean, I guess you could Skull Bash Squirtle, but I don't really see many people running Skull Bash, especially when you've got Mega Blast toys. Alright, so let's check on this Minin. It is level 10 and it's female. Alright, so... Okay, oh, so it's almost to the next level. Uh, minus, yeah, boost the special attack if there's another... Now, what would be really good if, is if I could get a Plusle. That would be so overpowered in double battles then. And have them partnered. Like, okay. So, he's got a neutral nature, and yeah, there she is. Alright, so Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, so a decent moveset, a decent moveset. Um, and now it is time for me to go back to the, po to the Pokemon Center. 
Okay, okay, here we go, right over here. And now we have to go talk to everyone about everything there is to do in Numio City. Um... Oh, I don't want to heal my Pokemon. Actually, yes, I do. Pikachu needs to be healed. Sorry, hi, I forgot about you. Alright, just so you know, all the Pokemon that I Wonder Trade that are, that, like, if I already have a full party, which I do right now, then it doesn't matter what, um, it doesn't matter what gender the Pokemon is that I Wonder Trade. Um, so, for instance, even though mine is female, if I were to Wonder Trade my next Pokemon, it's still my full party, like this party. If I were to Wonder Trade my next Pokemon, and it was, and it, let's say it was still, uh, and I got a female, that would be okay, because they're not partnered. Yet, at least. They might eventually be, but... Uh, well, they couldn't be, actually, if they were both the same gender, because that's- I don't play by that same gender rule. Okay, so I don't think we have to go talk to Shauna yet. And Trevor's guarding the exit, so he won't be able to leave. Let's just go talk to Serena. The lesser of two evils, I suppose, comparing her to Shauna. Okay, let's go on in here. I just magically hop off those roller skates, and I just slide back up my foot. And it looks like we've got Lysander and Diantha. Neighbor, just so you know, neighbor, Lysander is the head of Lysander Labs, which created the Holocaster, yeah, Holocaster, the Holocaust, gosh, so dumb sometimes, and Diantha is one of the most famous movie stars, and I'll give you a hint, she's also champion, so, <clears throat> basically, if you want to get the gist of this, Lysander is uh, asking if Diantha would want to be young and beautiful forever, and Diantha say, is taking a smart choice and saying no, that everyone must grow older, or something, yeah, I'm one of the most accomplished movie stars and Pokemon trainers, and if you'll excuse me, I'll just go beat up the whole world with Pokemon. Alright. And you... My name is Serena, and this is Thorns, right? I heard that Xander call you by those lovely names. Yes, because every parent wants to name their kid Thorns. Everyone wants to be like Overlord Thorns. Coming into battle. Hmm... Do I battle her yet? Oh crap, do I have to battle her? I'm gonna need to look up what she has, because this is a boss fight. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, guys, so you actually don't battle her. Alright, so let's just run along. Sorry about that, I was just, I was like, if this, if I do have to battle her, then I want to be prepared, you know? Alright, is Tierno gone? Or, I mean, Trevor? Yeah, Trevor's gone. Sweet. Hollow click received. Oh, yeah, we can move it around. Oh, let's look away. He's ugly. Tierno, so check this out. I'm on Route 5 right now, and it's just hopping with wild Pokemon. Hurry and come check it out, bro. <laughs> That's my new Tierno voice. <laughs> yeah, whenever I use the Holocaust... Holocaster! What is my problem? Holocaster! Yeah, I'm such an idiot sometimes. Whenever I use the Holocaster, I always, like, turn it away from their face. You know? It's like, because it's, it's kind of realistic. Oh no, it's the purple shirt maniac! Mr. Bonding. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's be the funniest name. Mr. Bonding. <laughs> okay. Alright, Mr. Bonding. I don't wanna I don't wanna meet you in a dark alley. <laughs> this is what I do when I play Pokemon. I just make lame jokes. Oh gosh. Whoa, Lucario, let's catch it and not wonder trade it. I didn't say anything. That's totally not what I did with all those other Pokemon. What? Wait, Lucario! Oh, you've got roller skates too? Oh, are you Rolanda? Rolanda? <laughs> roller skater Rolanda? Sorry about that, are you okay? Of course I'm okay, what do you think it like, close combat in my face? Nope. She's doing some- Actually, I think she's asking if I was okay after I met Mr. Bonding, and no, I'm not okay today. That guy creeps me out. I was just doing some special training with my Lucario when all of a sudden it dashed off. Lucario, what's going on with you? Did you get drawn by this boar's aura or something? That's kind of creepy, Lucario. I think it has something to do with Mr. Bonding. Oh, well, it seems Lucario likes you. Thanks. So Lucario can read people's auras. I guess he, something in your aura has made this one take a liking to strangers. So Lucario is always getting worked up in battle with my... <coughs> yeah, she's Karina, not Rolanda. Whoops, I thought your name was Rolanda, or going to be Rolanda. They see me Rolanda in. <laughs> Alright. Oh, sweet. It's like a roller derby. Woohoo! Oh yeah, oh yeah. Mmm, yeah. Oh yeah, so cool on my roller skates. Roller skating like Rolanda. I'm just gonna call her gym leader L Rolanda. And then there's gonna be Rolanda the second and Rolanda the third. 
Okay, so we've got some twinsies, and I think they have plus one mine on. Regardless, I think I'm gonna try Spritzy and Spoopa. I don't even know what level these Pokemon are, but they can't be that high leveled. Can they be? I think they have plus one mine on. I actually don't know, I'm just guessing. I think they do, but I don't know. Or they might both have Pichus. Oh, I was right! They mine it in plus hole! Oh, that is clutch! Good thing I decided not to use, um, Sigilith. Man, holy crap, if I use Sigilith, I might have lost this thing. Alright, we're just gonna tackle the plus hole, and we're going to Fairy Wind the plus hole. I'm targeting the plus hole. Who likes adding anymore? Okay, and now I'm paralyzed. Growl. Are you kidding me? Spoopa just got totally screwed over. Oh, okay, that did almost nothing. Crap. Okay, this is gonna be an extremely long battle. Oh my goodness. I have a feeling one of our po we are gonna lose a Pokemon in this battle. Yes! Get, just keep going for Thunder Wave. On my already paralyzed Pokemon. <laughs> That's really, really smart of you. Come on, we're almost done with this plus hole. Helping hand? No, don't help it. We want to kill it. Oh no. Oh my gosh! You get a crit. <sighs> Does helping hand like increase your critical hit ratio? You know, I have to sh say, Spoopy, you're doing really well for being paralyzed. Good job, Swoop. Level 12. Alright, good boy. Or good girl, sorry. Girl. Oh, wow! Almost got to the next level as well. Alright, sweet. Spritzy's growing to level 13. Echoed voice! Oh, yeah! Okay, I'm gonna forget. Wait, wait. What's Echoed voice's power? 40? So it's not that great, but I'm still gonna get rid of disabled. Oh, uh, really? I get that now? Because I think that would have hit both Puzzle and Minin. Yeah, of course, now I learn it. Right after I kill the plus hole. Mm, not the happiest camper right now. Alright, let's go for another quick attack. Okay, Spoopa is just having to take a crap load of, a, of damage. Um, oh yes, yeah, still not paralyzed. Is there something in Spoopa's ability? Good job, Spoopa. Man, really pulling through. Okay, okay, now stop targeting Spoopa, that's not very nice. Yes, Spoopa, yes. Are we seriously not going to get fully paralyzed at all this battle? Okay, now they're going for Spritzy. Fairy Wind, flap your little birdie wing, Spritzy, and we take down the Minun. So all the turns that, or that Spoopa was able to attack, it didn't get fully paralyzed a single turn. Good job, Spoopa. Good job. Oh my gosh! Spoopa just grew another level, and I'm gonna have to go in a minute. Oh my gosh, and Spritzy just grew a level. And, oh my goodness, that gave so much experience. Come on, Vivian, 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 Vivian. Yes, we're getting a Vivian! Yes, guys, what a way to end off the episode with Spoopa evolving into Vivian. This is gonna be great, guys. This is gonna be absolutely fantastic. So we're gonna be getting our own Vivian. Oh, so great. Second Pokemon to be fully evolved this whole game. And it's Vivian. Alright, that is some beautiful looking art on your wings, Vivian. And at that, I think I'm gonna end off the episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode of my Pokemon Wonder Weblock. And I will see you guys all next time. Goodbye for now.